That was some sweet villain victory. Up Wedding Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89. Today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Boku no Hero Academia chapter 241. So I'm sorry the content's a little bit later than it usually is um, this week. Uh, it's because, especially today, um, I'm going to Crunchyroll Expo and um, I actually wanted to get a little bit of extra sleep since I'm going to be there for a good 10 hours <laughs> and I don't want to pass the fuck out in the quiet room. <laughs> But, um, because uh, there's a lot of shit that I'm going to be doing at Crutcher World Expo today. I'm so excited. I haven't gotten into my costume yet. I need to. Uh, but anyway, um, I'm really kind of sad because this, it looks like we're, we're, the villain arc is officially over. We're going back to the hero arc. And I really, really, really hope that Horikoshi is not going to lose a spark. I really hope that spark is going to stay alive going into this. Anyway, let's get to this chapter and see what happens next. Um, at the U, uh, a high, um, at the UA high student dorms, a mere 30 minutes after obtaining their provisional licenses, these two have put the pros to shame with their heroics. You two must, you two must get along really well during your regular training sessions, right? Pissed. Oh my god, it's Bakugo and Todoriki off the bed. If that's how you see it, you should get your damn eyes checked or your brain. And Todoriki's like all vacant and we get along great. Huh? Bullshit. Why don't we become all buddy buddy? We were coming together all the time during the supplementary classes, weren't we? What kind of system do you have in your head? Time and friendship aren't directly proportional, damn it. <laughs> what do you mean by system? How should I know? Why don't, I, why don't you get your brain checked to find out if everyone is like, what the fuck is going on? This is like the best. Or could you please keep this? Let's keep this up. This is the spark I'm talking about. Oh god, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ugh. Um, it's finally the hero's turn to shine. No! Oh yay, it's my villain academia! Oh, I just noticed that! Uh, Deku, um, is holding the text that says hero and Bakugo is holding, um, is holding villain. I miss my villain academia! Come back, my villain academia! Um, and this chapter is titled, um, Answer the Interviews. Late December, a few days before the end of the semester. Hi, yeah, 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 we get along great. They were interviewed for an entire hour. No, I wasn't afraid. His face is Kakako. <laughs> His face is cut off the whole time. And Bakugo got completely, got cut off completely. You can see the reporters were actually protecting him. Put me, eh, assholes. <laughs> I love you, Bakugo. Getting further and further away from All Might. Bakugo's really lost it. Get your box off the desk, Minetta. <laughs> I can hear you, Shiku, and you too, Ballhead. Um, that was their third interview, and yet Bakugo's managed to let the good reputation he could have gotten from the inc that incident go completely to waste. <laughs> well, it's Bakugo, what do you expect? Those two may be a tad unsophisticated, but as provisional heroes, they're clearly very competent. I'm sure they want to become full-fledged pros as quickly as they can. With pro heroes like them, hopefully we can avoid a second, um, uh, Deka-like tragedy. Nine days have tra uh, nine days have passed since the incident. A mere 20 people brought Deka City to the brink of, uh, ruin in only 50 minutes. Holy shit! So that whole arc was 50 minutes! Oh my god! Apparently, the scale of destruction is even greater than Kamino, but since it was a rural area, there were fewer casualties. It has been, um, it is believed to have been a uh, planned act of hostility and attempted to degrade the hero's, um, reputation, but what did Deka's citizens have to say? It's foolish to say, uh, it's foolish to place any blame on the saviors of Deka. What we should really be, uh, disputing is the unreliability of the current system. I can't blame Deka's, uh, pro heroes for what happened. All I have to say is, um, to the people calling for investigation is this. Hindsight is twenty twenty. I think the heroes should do a better job. We're rooting for them now. Um, at first, the idea that the heroes were set up was circulated and the, and the heroes were um, enduring constant attack. Uh, but I believe this could also be a turning point, and that's the hero critic, um, Aorio e Crisis. <laughs> I love his name. That's great. So the attacks um, and criticism towards heroes have uh, now transitioned to words of encouragement. People are taking it a, um, a little better than uh, they did before the whole uh, can't you see kind of thing? The can't you see kind of thing? All thanks to Endeavor's efforts, I guess. I wouldn't be so optimistic. 
it might feel like the heroes have the winds in their sails again, but if you flip the situation to its backside, people are actually feeling a sense of urgency. The shouts of encouragement from those who were promised vic uh, justice is victory. Oh my god, the ass. Are pra uh, reality prayers of desperation. Okay, I haven't looked at Twitter yet this morning, but if there's SJWs on Twitter protesting about that ass, I'm going to be really, really mad because Horkoshi, that ass is, 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 is beautiful. That is some glorious ass right there. Oh my god. In today's society where so many heroes are caught up in the showbiz of it all, the people are yearning for a true hero to emerge. Oh, there's some tits and there's some ass. Oh my god. Mount Lady? What? She was invited here as a guest lecturer since you guys have been getting more media exposure lately. Midnight's escorting her. Where's my exposure? It's all right, man. There's always next time. Uh, this may not sound much like um, sound like much coming from me, uh, but she's been more tainted by showbiz than anyone. Shut it, you! <laughs> Today's class will be a practical seminar about the media. I, the beautiful center of attention in the hero world, will teach you all there is to know about uh, um, how a hero should carry themselves. I can only imagine what you'll have us uh, do, but let's plus ultra this lesson, everyone. We'll be practicing hero interviews. That was some amazing work out there, Shoto. What are you talking about? Uh, pretend, pretend you just finished a tough job or something. Uh, action, okay. What sort of hero are you trying to become, Shoto? Here we go. The kind of hero that puts everyone at ease when he arrives. That's wonderful. Although, if a hunk like you came to save me, it might make my, first, uh, my heart burst out of my chest. Is there something wrong with your heart? Is this kid for real? He's so cute, I want him. <laughs> Dude, you just want to protect Hodoriki. <laughs> like, oh my god. So what kind of, I, I understand the, the Todoriki stands, but my god, I, I, I'm, I'm a full on Bakugo stand. You ain't converted me. Horkoshi, you ain't converted me yet. <laughs> um, so what kind of super uh, moves do you have? Uh, heaven piercing, uh, heaven piercing ice wall. It has a wide variety of applications such as suppressing villains over a wide area, stopping them in their tracks, or making a foothold for myself. Um, I have another, I also have another technique that's a little more violent. Um, it's called swelling, uh, a swelling icy heat wave. Is that the one he used during the battle against Class B? Yeah, Endeavor's thing. Flash fire fist. Um, that's his technique. Uh, that's his technique. But right now, I can't even hold a candle to him. I'm going to climb even higher. I don't want to go as far as um, uh, to try and change your um, go as far as try and change your personality. But if you really want to put uh, the people at ease, you should try and smile. If you can try, if you can smile at, at, at all the ladies out there, um. The, um, and all the ladies out there, they'll be dropping left and right. They'll die from me smiling? Oh, for the love of next! Holy fucking god. Um, so we're demonstrating our super moves as well? I thought this was about interviewing. Come now, Mr. UA student. Not everyone out there knows who you guys are. Super moves help show uh, the people who you are. If you want everyone to know what you are um, capable of, it sh you'll have to show them with your mo um, with your moves. Whether it's your uh, form whether it's performing impromptu teams, sending out a warning of a villain attack, or earning tr people's trust so they trust their and trust their lives to you. There's a significant meaning in a hero shouting out their uh, out the names of their super moves. You know, until just recently, that chick was only paying attention to how she looked on camera. She's changed. It's not just Mount Lady. Right now, all the heroes are all being um, pulled along by the number one. I spring into action as the inheritor of my brother, Ingenium's will. I can feel your sincerity. I've got a strong memory, breadth of, um, breadth of knowledge, and I can create anything and everything. Confidence goes a long way. For me, everything weighs nothing. Taking the edge off is a, um, a talent in and um, of itself. Those who don't embrace the darkness shall never achieve true glory. Dude, that was awesome. I love that. That, that was awesome. Ooh, nice vibes. No blood will be shed as long as you're behind me. That's our um, not bad, everyone. I guess I have nothing to worry about. You can do it if you try. I got nothing to say to you fools. Just shut up and follow me. <laughs> <laughs> so I say I fucking go stand. I can't. I can't. I can't not stand. I cannot. I cannot. I, I, like, I fucking love Bakugo so much. Um... Well, you're just, you're a bit better when you're alone. Guess you just don't get along well with anyone. Um, sorry he ended up getting completely cut out because I was there. Quit acting so cocky. There's no way a scrub like you would have an effect on me. <laughs> oh, 
okay. Maybe he should start uh, taking lessons in avoiding the media from Aizawa. <laughs> no, there's someone else you should uh, be learning from right now. Uh, you're Deku, right? I saw you fighting the good fight out there today. Oh, that's nice. I'm happy to hear that. Uh, can you give me your thoughts on what happened today? I'm happy to hear that. Whoa, he can use hardening just like me. <laughs> That's a next level stage fright, but I guess he hasn't had many opportunities like us. It seems like a lot of your techniques are inspired by All Might. Do you look up to him? Yes, and now he gets loud. But I just, I thought I just, uh, um, but I thought just imitating wasn't enough. So, um, that's why I'm trying to customize All Might's moves in my own way. For example, I chose the new Delaware because that particular state. Where have All Might's, um, uh, I've recently decided to do all my training directly to call Delaware at airports. So is he gonna, ever gonna stop muttering himself? Come to think of it, I heard you've been making progress ever since that outburst you had during training. How's that coming along? Ooh, that presence has since disappeared. It's been a week since that incident. Oh, oh, we've been waiting for this. Um, I've been working on both image and practical training since then. That presence has since disappeared. No, it hasn't disappeared. That previous one for um, one for all user told told me to master my power. It was a power meant to be uh, used down the road to, uh, so it was just locked away, but it's still there. And the fact, oh, I love this. Poor Koshi, this is great shit. So you see, you have um, Deku visualizing the door with the locks and it's making me think of, uh, um, um, of the Fallen because that's how uh, Lucifer um, unlocked the doors to hell uh, that were, you know, in his mind. So yeah, that I really, really like this. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Horikoshi, that spark is still here. That spark is still here. Um, and the fact that it's locked away means that I should be able to choose when I unlock it. Um, I'm past the past. Uh, I'm boring solution. I'm past the phase where I have to suppress it from here on out. Just like I became able to control the percentage of uh, one for all, I need to output just the right amount of that power for me in my current state. Ooh. All right. Right now it just kind of goes bloop and disappears, but I've t taken the first step towards uh, properly controlling it, but uh, surely, uh, slowly but surely, all oh, what the hell was that? Quit acting so happy about a bloop. <laughs> Quit acting so happy about a bloop. <laughs> you still haven't slept? Principal, not to worry, I'm sleeping just fine. There's no cause for concern. God doesn't even begin to describe what you look like right now. Since most of them um, came from a long past age, uh, the records are pretty sparse. Uh, losing sleep is bad for your fur. Generations of successor quirks. Uh, notes for young Midoriya. Fight. Oh, that's so nice. We received a report you see very soon. We'll be restarting the Android ships. <gasps> yes! Go back to the... Oh, Android ship time is coming. Become strong. Show them who you are. I can't believe you weren't nervous up there. Ooh, the internships are going to be very interesting. Todoriki better be going with the Never. Like, I want to see the Todoriki Never internship again. I need that shit. Uh, I need, 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 need that Todoriki Endeavor um, internship to happen. That That's going to be such an interesting arc. Because, um, there, I, and it will be like such a good growing period for not just Todoriki, but for Endeavor too. So I, I'm really looking forward to that. But this chapter... I really showed it, it, it's giving me confidence that um, Horikoshi is keeping that spark that we had from My Villain Academia alive because um, like the, the comedy was here um, and everything and it felt really good to see this it really feels good um, <laughs> um, it's going to be but the other thing that I really like that we're seeing here is how Endeavor's kind of influencing everyone, um, in a way. Like, all right, well, influencing slash inspiring everyone to be a little bit more serious. And I really like that. Um, I'm very curious what you guys thought of this chapter. Um, and do you guys think that Horikoshi's going to be able to keep the spark going? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And also, what kind, what internships are you looking forward to seeing? I, and who do you think Deku's going to intern with in particular? Uh, but uh, I'm really, really... And I want to know who Bakugo could intern with this time. Uh, if Bakugo interns um, with Aizawa, I'm gonna lose my shit. That would be fucking awesome. But, uh, but my God, I I, I really uh, out of all the internships that I'm looking forward to, I think the one that Horikoshi's gonna really do a beautiful story arc for, and it's been building. Is and I'll be sad if we don't get it. Is Endeavor and, Tod and Todoriki. 
that's gonna be a fucking fantastic one let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and remember to like comment share and subscribe to nerdy can think if you love what i'm doing i want to help keep this channel alive so i can keep bringing you more um book when i hear academia content there's a few ways uh, that you can do that you can donate to my paypal patreon go find me purchase something off my amazon wish list all that's in the description box below also make sure you follow me on twitter twitch facebook find me on playstation network that's in the description box below as well until next time nerdy i will be seeing you later bye